Hi guys and welcome to a new video, hope you're all doing well. Um, I thought I would do another hair video today, I've actually been dying to do this video and it's basically using the Babyliss 1000 air style on my hair. Um, now it's short, now obviously I did a honest review on this product a few, quite a few videos um, ago now and it was quite a popular video and it seems a lot of people were interested obviously on this product and how it works and I, one thing I did say in that video is I think it would be better for short hair and since I've cut my hair um, obviously it used to be a lot longer than this I love it I use this every single time I dry my hair and I am literally obsessed with it so I thought I would film an updated review and show you how I style my hair with it now it's short so I'm going to be using only two attachments today which will be this flat one and also the small curling barrel and yeah I'll be showing you what I do on a day to day basis of just me drying my hair I will use this flat brush which again in the last video I said I didn't really see the point of it like I didn't need to use this I use this all the time now I don't normally I have brushed my hair today but what I will normally do is just use this and not use another hairbrush and it will just dry my hair quite straight and just quite natural and I'm obsessed with it so I will be using this set this flat brush first just to really dry like the roots and the underneath and then I will be using the curling um, attachment and yeah we'll go from there so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to separate my hair so I will section it using just normal hair grips because otherwise it will take me all year to dry That is it completely dry and straight. I mean, it's not completely dry. I did try and leave a bit of it damp because to curl it, I am going to need it damp. So what you can do is you can obviously use the curling appliance straight away, but I don't find that it gets in your roots enough where, because it's more, though it's blowing air out, it's really not that powerful, like as an actual hair dryer. So I like to make sure my roots and underneath is all definitely dry and then I will go in with this. So I'm just going to swap the head over from the flat one to the other one bear in mind this is quite hot so just be very good if we're using this just be very careful there's also hair on the inside somehow um yeah don't touch this bit because it is hot and then we'll just put that on it just clips in place just like that and then we've got a glove because like i said it's very hot and what i will do now um obviously to do this your hair does you can do this on dry hair but it will not give you the same effect it will not last as long so i'm going to need to spray my hair but what i'm going to do um, I'm trying to think of what I'm going to set. If I really, depending on what sort of curls I want, it depends how I section my hair, which is pretty standard to any sort of curling method, whether you're using any product. But yeah, so I'm just going to spray my hair, which I know seems mad that I've just spent time drying it and I'm going to spray it, but I am doing this section at a time as well. I'm going to grab a section about this big and then I'll... Right, so that is that side completely curled. I keep using gel spray so I've hairspray but I've never used a gel spray on actually curled hair. Right, so I'm just going to do the same to this side. I do find it quite difficult to hold the hair in place because it's so short. So that is it styled. It's, I don't know if it's hard to see or not. Um, on my viewfinder, it looks really difficult to see the like my hair because <laughs> it's a little dark. Um, that is how I style my hair to make it curly whilst it's short. Um, I definitely think I, I think have when I've had this hair short, I always prefer it when it is curly. I just don't do it enough because I'm so lazy. Like that is a lot of effort. And essentially I do find it is the exact same like method as using a heat styler but I find using a heat styler would actually make the curls um, more defined because it's a hot hot at all like 
And the other thing with this is, you don't know if you could see it whilst I was doing it, especially because I probably time-lapsed it. Um, I'll put it on the hot setting if I can, but especially here it started actually burning my scalp. So I put it on the cool setting, but it still works. But like I try and put it on the hot setting and then the cool setting because obviously putting it on cool doesn't do as much. I feel like that side's a lot curlier. It's just nice, it gives it a lot more volume, it just makes it look like I've actually bothered with my hair. Like I do love the tool, I'm so glad I've started using it again. And like I said, I use it every single time I dry my hair now, even if it's just a flat brush because it just makes such a difference, it makes my hair so smooth. Although it's not as powerful as a hair dryer, which is what I said in my previous video, the fact like I don't have to use a brush and I can just literally just brush brush it through and it dries it's just so much easier it's so much easier like I like anything that makes my life easier and things like quicker um because I always found especially because I've got a bit of a funny shoulder if I'm using a brush and a hair dryer my arm aches but with that I'm just using one one hand all the time but yeah I hope that's given you a little insight into the air styler like I said I know I've done this video before but it's a bit this is purely how I style it now I've got short hair and my current thoughts on it I literally couldn't recommend it enough um, for those of you that want something a bit quicker or easier for hair styling and you don't want to use or if you don't want to use stuff that is too hot because it is definitely a lot more like I find it's a lot healthier for your hair because it's not nowhere near as hot and you're not using a hairdryer and a heat tool you're just using one tool it's just more convenient quicker easier um cheap and it's obviously a lot cheaper than a lot of products out there definitely recommend it as a christmas present as well if you don't know what to get like your mum or your sister or whoever if you don't know this video is part of my daily upload thing that i've got going on up until christmas i am sort of doing like vlogmas but i'm doing main videos as well so i'm just calling it like festive videos uploads i don't know i haven't really got a name for it um but yeah so if you are interested in christmas and christmas content and just vlogging in general i am like i said doing daily uploads on my channel so please hit that subscribe button if you want to see more this is kind of like crazy to do but i'm doing obviously the main videos like this to break up the vlogs a little bit and just to keep things fresh and not bore you to death um but yeah if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and catch up on all the rest of the videos i'm doing throughout december and i will see you tomorrow for a new video bye